Well, the title is Time Space uh, because it's about the passage of time. I'm 83 years old. I've been painting since I was, I mean, been professionally working since I was 18. I've had a lot of years to think through a lot of things. And one thing that influenced me was I grew up spending summers on a small island and was very aware of the horizon, of the turning of the earth and so on. And a lot of my paintings are day to night and then back to dawn. Some of the other pieces are about one minute to the next. Anything about time's motion. This painting behind me with four of me sitting around the table. It's not very literal, but it's a conversation with myself, like a meeting of Susan the artist with Susan the artist with Susan the artist and so on. And the rings of the tree are about the life of the tree. So it's covering a longer period of time. It may be flat this way, but it's deep, visually and also it's actually in layers. I'm having a conversation about probably about how to make the next painting. <laughs> When I go to leave home to go to the studio, I always say to my husband, I'm going to my playroom. <laughs> it's where I'm joyfully with myself and continue the exploration, one painting to the next and so on. I did a number of paintings with these kind of Edwardian ladies and so on, cutting them up, moving them around, and it's a large form of collage. She's turning and inside is the birds singing. Of course, birds here too, these are flamingos. Flamingos are collaged elements from images off the internet and there are larger flamingos inside the bird image and smaller ones outside. It's just a, a feeling of motion here. They're all friends, they all like each other. <laughs> They're in my forward-looking time. I mean, it's my mental observations of the world. I don't travel a lot. My son travels all the time, but I don't travel a lot, but I travel in my mind. 